Hello, hello everyone. It's me, Jessica, and welcome back to my channel. Um, today we are going to dive in to some Legacy House. Um, I'm always so excited to get in and do this. And today in real life is actually Nifty Knitting Stuff Pack Day. And I'm really excited to, um, sorry, can I readjust here? Have the like elder's hair. So I went ahead and I have put um, like the salt and pepper kind of hair on Marco and our Lady Luna. I put the like the hair that looks like Kitty from that 70s show. I put that hair on her. So they have the the, the elder hair, um, I guess you could call it. Um, I did sprinkle some other stuff throughout. We do have a sick dog and I'm not sure if she went to the bathroom inside or if that's just from her being sick. Um, but we do have treats um, in Marco's, or not Marco, I'm sorry, Quentin's inventory actually. So we're going to have Quentin um, give her a vet treat because I like to just have the, the wellness treats in the inventory. It's easier than trying to go, oh my gosh, she looks so cute. It's easier than trying to go in and, uh, you know, take them to the vet and everything. Like, how cute is she? Honestly, Pharma. I'm gonna need you to stop it, Lovely. Luna. You're adorable. I mean, she just rocks it. She really does. She's uh, doing her best here. Mm. Good boy. Oh, she's oh, so cute. I just love her. Okay, well, um. Oh, okay, it looks like the pup is, is happy now. Yes. Oh, no. Okay. All right. Well, anyways, I did give Violet. Um, I don't think she's wearing it, but she has... Where is she? Oh, okay. She has the new top um, from the Nifty Knitting Pack. Kind of tried to incorporate some stuff here and there. Oh, and of course... Um, weird. Okay, that was very strange. Um, I put a rocking chair over here. So there's actually more of like a, a little setup for knitting in a sense. And I do technically have, um, it's kind of hard to see. Um, Halloween was awful, goodness. There's two knitting baskets right here. Um, what else I think? Oh, I made some changes y'all. I just kind of forgot to mention because the game crashed last time. And this is the only save file I'm having trouble with the game crashing in. Um, but I have this light on auto because I figured it would maybe help with the environment around here because it went back to neutral, which is besides the point. Um, I'm just kind of going to ramble for a second. We've got some updates, I guess you could say. Um, but I put, and I'll turn the light on so you can actually see, but I put some of the nifty knitting stuff out here. Um, surely there we go it turned on okay so this is our little um, crafting room which now has like the knitting station I put a little bit of just like decorations and some stuff like that we've got you know the little pad here that looks like it would have maybe some like um, patterns and stuff um, I put the little like you're working on it in the corner um, just so there's some touches some little character in this room because um, otherwise it's just kind of some eco lifestyle stuff. Um, I did have her working on a beauty tips video so we'll just go ahead and call it that. Oh and Quentin reached level 7 comedy? Get out of here. Okay add transitions to that. Sweet. Um, she's gonna come out here and I guess we can tell her to just not worry about this. I kind of feel bad because she's already on her way, but honestly, Quentin's down here and I don't want her to die because she doesn't, okay, witness to a bully. Always step in and stand up for your friend. Always step in. That's how I feel at least. Um, scavenge for parts right there then. Is she still? 
she's still trying to come out here. Okay, so um, it'll be easier to see in the, the morning everything else that I did, but there is actually a like basketball court. Um, goodness. So there's a basketball court right here. Um, I, I kind of actually like hedged it in. Oh goodness, she just walked right through those hedges. Okay. Um, <laughs> I tried to hedge it in, but I guess it didn't make any difference. Um, trying to, goodness me. I love being in free camera, but it's, it's kind of crazy sometimes. So there's like this little tree right here that wasn't there before, and this tree was not here before, um, but I like adding trees in. Okay, so also over here, oh my gosh, Nova. Nova, what are you doing? You're adorable. She's just out here swimming around. Okay. Um, well, this is the new pool area. What I did is I raised everything up onto the deck. So the deck actually extends out here now. Um, you can maybe see it a bit better in just normal camera, honestly. Um, but we have stairs like over here. We have stairs over here. <laughs> and we have stairs over here. I wanted for it to be like very accessible. You can walk around, do all your stuff. Um, and I just felt like maybe that would help with um, some of the foundational issues because I don't have everything on the same foundation, so it's kind of weird. Anyways, I'm just rambling at this point about foundation stuff and the deck and the pool. I think that that's pretty much everything that I changed though. Okay, so edit video. All right, and Quentin, what are you doing? Adunda, Wallakoi, oh. Okay, Tamar. so what I'm thinking is we're gonna give Nara. Oh, Quentin. Um, I think let's give Nara that basket because it's closer to the fireplace, which makes me feel like it would be more of a fire hazard. Quentin, it's so cute. Oh no, does she have to go potty and he's trying to take a shower? This is not going to work out. No, 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 the awkwardness. Why is she, oh, she's embarrassed because she peed her pants. Oh no. Oh, take a bubble bath. I'm uh, hoping that we get to have a baby in this part. Yeah, we should. We should absolutely be able to have a baby in this part, guys. Um, so I actually have done a really bad job at um, mentioning name suggestions for Nara's baby. But if you do have name suggestions, please drop them below for Nara's baby. If you're following the story, if you're excited about Nara's baby, I am excited about her baby. I'm super, super ready to have her baby here. Honestly, I cannot wait. Boy or girl, I don't care. I'm so excited for Nova to have like a cousin um, and to kind of just be able to have that like family feeling, especially if they do present story progression in the, like just the game because I play on console. And so I don't, I don't have any mods. Um, but yeah, if we do get story progression, I will move out any cousins and stuff like that and it would make me feel like we could have more kids because I just like to know what's going on. I like to know that they're going to like get married and have a life or something like that or have a job. Like if you don't want to get married, you know, are they going to like work? Like what are they going to do? All right. Anywho, I'm rambling about that. She has got her bath in. Okay. Well, hopefully she's in a bit of a better mood now. Um... Violet, honey, are you done? <laughs> she should be done, honestly. Um, Nova, is her homework done? Is everything good for her? Yeah, she's good to go. All right, well, she's going to school today, and she's a big kid. I can't. Oh, that is weird. Okay, well, that, that's awkward. <laughs> They're standing inside of each other. Okay, um, 
I think that we probably cannot really do much more. So we're gonna upload that video and then we'll, uh, we'll do some eating or something. Oh goodness. Is our dog not going outside? Or is that from Nara? That might be from Nara actually. We know that she did pee her pants. I don't know where, but we do know that she did. Girl, you about to pop and I'm ready for it. Oh my gosh, the cutest little bean right here. I love Nova, love. Oh, but she's sleepy. Oh well. Um, it looks like Luna did not finish. Uh oh, Luna's very tired. Okay, let's have her actually sleep. Like Marco is sleeping like a normal person. Real good job there. Oh, but he need to use the restroom. How are you guys doing though in the uh, the real world? Hopefully good. Hopefully good. Um, change outfit. Let's get her in her cold weather outfit because it's cute. <laughs> <You. laughs> I don't think I changed any of her outfits. I kind of thought about it, but I'm quite happy with her outfits and so I did not. Is it go to school? Go to school. Go to school, kiddo. Yeah. Okay. Sorry, I don't know if that was annoying or not, but I'm so excited for her to age up. Like I want it to just happen to today, um, but it is not her time to age up. Not even close, I don't think. Yeah, no, we have, we have a, a little bit of time. Which is so disappointing, honestly quite disappointing. Oh, is she still mopping? Oh, honey. Um, let's have her come and use the restroom, honestly, and then she can come and grab some leftovers. She's kind of going through it right now. Okay, so we need to continue writing comedy routines for Quentin's aspiration, and he needs to join the comedy branch whenever we get there of his entertainment career. Um, so what are we doing with his career right now? He has everything that he needs to do done. He does need to achieve level two of the guitar or violin skill. Um, he does not go to work for another eight hours. So we should be able to get his guitar skill where it needs to be. Marco. He needs to come down and uh, Grab some leftovers. I'm trying to see what's spoiled in here though. Okay, um, so there's gonna be a little cut there. I had to deal with the TV issue actually. Um, but this is spoiled. <laughs> Let's tell him to come and grab this hot dog. The dog, Mika, she needs a bath. Um, I think actually, oh yeah, let's tell him to do it because he seems to be in a pretty good mood. Give Mika a bath. I do kind of want to go to the hospital for this baby to be born, but I'm not sure that we will 100%. I, I don't want to like make any promises that I can't keep. Um, okay, so we gave her the knitting basket, right? Right, I, I'm pretty sure. Right, right, right. Yes, okay. So she has the knitting basket. Um, oh, bills have been delivered. Hey, bills, $385. $385, I'm sorry, not dollars, simoleons. That is nothing. We paid like 12,000 simoleons last time. That is crazy. Okay. 
Oh my gosh, that is, that's seriously awesome. Um, I wanted to make her knit, but it looks like she's quite tired. I'm sorry, Nora. I wanted to make Nora knit, but it looks like she's very tired. Um, so I just, I kind of feel bad for her. Why, Nora and Violet are just not homies. I don't know what it is, but they really do not seem to be the best of friends. And uh, I, I feel bad for Violet, honestly. Um, Violet is very lonely, and I'm trying to get her to talk to Nara, since she's so, so lonely. <laughs> You gonna talk to her? You d didn't have to like sit so far. Oh, did I? Is her fella balloon? Hoo harpin, Couture, Dobie. Ah, moosh. Maybe um, discuss some fitness techniques. I want for them to be better friends. Like genuinely, I don't know why they are not at least kind of friends. Ah, Sabal, Lavar. <laughs> oh, did she level up her fitness just by like talking about fitness? Yes, keep talking, girls. Keep talking. I think Violet rocks that two tone lipstick. Okay, our eco footprint is green again. I don't know what like made it go not green, but it did. Um, so what I'm kind of thinking is Nara is probably going to start staying in the main house. Is the maid dying? <gasps> Why does this always happen to me? The maid is dying on our lot. This is not the death that I saw coming. This is not, it's not the death that I saw coming. Is it rude of me to not pay attention? Like what? Is she trying to come and witness death? She is. Oh no. Well, Grim, you, I hope that you don't feel like you need to hang out. Hopefully Marco is not on your list today. <laughs> the poor maid, man, this is not what I um, had in mind at all. Marco rocking that new hair though, he looks great. Oh my gosh. The maid is dead, y'all. You're gonna have to clean your house a little bit better in the meantime while we're waiting on a new maid. Oh my god. We didn't really know her. I think we talked to her a couple times, but it's been a long time since we did talk to her. Grim, take her away. Violet's going upstairs. Okay, well, this is not what I had in mind. Not at all. All right. All righty then. Let's um, go ahead and tell him to come on over and grill up some grilled chicken. Because it's a weird day, and the maid just died. Luna slept right through it. Um, we have more spoiled food to clean out. All right, let's have her get up and grab a bit potato. Quentin, why are you coming down here to sleep? He's trying to nap. Oh, that's not good. And he has to work in four hours. Okay. Um, need for him to just come over here and sleep. 
Okay, we have some plants that need to be evolved, but it's always so hard to tell which ones they are. Um, but I have him coming down here to supercell some stuff. We don't have any more dragon fruits. These are all snapdragons right now. Okay. The garden that never stops. <laughs> this is probably something that I could actually clean out a little bit um, to make room on the lot. I, I just, I like having such a big garden in the legacy play. I really do. We have a nice gardener that helps us take care of it. I just don't want to get rid of it. Oh, Luna came out here to hang out with him. Okay, these are pomegranate trees. I want to get an avocado tree here. Um, but we can have him come over here and supercell as well. Um, I kind of want for them to be maybe a little flirty, Luna and Marco, because we don't know how much longer they have. You know, it could be a few more parts. It could be today. I, you know, who knows? Oh no, Nova's going to pass out. This is not my finest hour, apparently. Um, but we will have her. Oh, poor girl. I'm sorry. <laughs> I'm sorry. Um, but we'll have her go and sleep whenever she gets up. She can rest up a bit. Luna and Mark. Oh. Why is that hair the old hair? Maybe it's just not fixed right now. Um... Give him a big old smooch. Is he feeling like insecure? Oh, yes. Okay. <laughs> Sorry, I had it paused for a second. I wanted to make sure I had some stuff queued up. So I want, I want a romantic moment. He seems kind of down. I think he's sad from the whole maid situation, dying in front of him and whatnot, you know? Um, he does seem like he's actually in a flirty mood, though, so... Um... Let's go and have them... Just do some good old woohoo. I'm not specifically trying to instigate death but I do want them to have a moment real quick you know just why not seems like a perfectly fine idea to me I don't see any reason why not it could go horribly wrong let's be honest um it, it could absolutely go in the wrong direction and um i could kill them via woohoo and that's not specifically what i'm trying to do but don't know that it's not what i'm trying to do either <laughs> would never say that though i would never do that um yeah, let's have her love on Mika a bit. She did have the uh, friend of the animals aspiration whenever we got her, um, Violet, like when we added her to the family. But I just, oh, are they talking? Um, I just feel like she's more of a renaissance sim in my opinion. So we're gonna focus on that aspiration for her. She is autonomously asking her if she wants to feel her belly. She is autonomously asking right now if she would like to feel her belly. And um, I wanted to make sure that we are 100% a part of this moment. Oh my gosh, yes. Yes, 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 yes. I really just want for Nara to have the baby. I just, I want for her to go into labor. That is pretty much it. 
Um, oh, is he so, oh, he's supposed to be at work. Oh no. Quentin, how late are you? Oh, oh, he's an hour late. Okay, he's late. There is no denying it. He is absolutely late. Oh, oh my gosh. How could I have forgotten? I 100% did something else on the lot. Um, and I do need to show you guys what I did. Okay, so this is now a ladder. You now go down ladder or a, <laughs> you go down ladder to get downstairs. You go down the ladder to get downstairs, um, words. Anyways, um, this is now our downstairs. So what I've done down here is all the boxes now have labels, frogs, fish, so on, my sims, trophies, crystals, fossils, and I've got like one of each sitting out so that, um, and there's a fish above this one, so that you can kind of tell what's what. Um, these are just two extra boxes over here, the elements, this is a project that Quentin did, or Nara actually, I'm sorry. Um, but then over here we have a sauna now. I'm sorry, you probably saw the woohoo with sauna option and were like, wait, what's that? Um, but there's also a little potty down here. Um, the like potion of youth room is still off limits, but I just kind of changed it around so that there's kind of some stuff to do um, down here. And yeah, that's, that's where I'm at. <laughs> Are you gonna have this baby? Oh gosh, it's beautiful. Nara, are, are you going to have this baby? She is genuinely so cute. I think she is the cutest of the cutes. I love her. I, I love her. Oh. <laughs> oh, she's... I don't know what that noise was. Okay, so she's gone into labor. Um... Okay, no, we're not going to go to the hospital because we have this um, adorable nursery here, so why would we need to go to the hospital? And I'm not quite so worried about a birth certificate for her baby. If it was an heir, like Nova's baby, we would probably feel a bit more inclined. Um, I'm so excited. I'm so excited. Boy or girl? Boy or girl? What do you guys think? It's a girl, it's a girl, it's a girl. Okay, Melanie, Bridget, Shayla. Okay, here's what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna name her Shay. I'm gonna name her Shay. And if you guys have a different name in mind um, or something like that, just let me know. Let me know what you're thinking. Because um, for right now, little baby Shay, I think it's cute. I have always liked that name. And it's not one that I had picked out specifically for any of our heirs. So what we're going to do is, oh, lunch break. He has a 30 minute lunch break. Um, read blogs for career advice because you were late to work today. And then go ahead and breastfeed your baby. Because we're here, we have a baby, we're here. Okay, I, um, sorry, I'm gonna get in here a little bit. Oh, she's so cute. Little Mama Nara, y'all. Okay, well, I guess this Aww. is probably a pretty good spot to cut it. Um, like I said, if you have ideas for names, let me know. <laughs> In the next part, um, I think we're actually going to get out and do a like a comedy oh. show for Quentin. If it's not um, like a day that he has to go to work or do anything oh, crazy, um, no one dies immediately or anything like that. Um, I'm so excited though. We have another baby. Jabbing. But yeah, thank you guys so much for stopping by. I hope you guys are staying safe out there, having a great day, and I will catch y'all later. Bye!